Here at home, many businesses are already back open tonight with that stay at home order lifted. KSBY News reporter Alexa Bertola talked with those in the beauty and personal care service industry about being able to resume business once again. The lights are back on. Salons and barber shops are able to reopen their doors after the regional stay at home order was lifted. Now those in the industry, along with customers, are elated for the news. Today is my first day back. With the open sign illuminated, Barbara Armando Tamayo of Stay Sharp Barber Shop is back doing what he loves following the shop's closure in early December. It was kind of tough because, I mean, we can't be cutting hair, making money. With the industry closed for nearly two months straight, it's been a struggle to get by. Financially, it was kind of hard. I had to get a part-time job. Buttercup Beauty opened for the first time ever in September of 2020 to only be closed in early December. It's been really hard um, being in an industry that you never thought was going to be hit like this. On Monday, the salon reopened again. Owner Blakely Bryan says her phone has been flooded with calls and texts. It's kind of been a whirlwind. Barber shops and salons alike are already experiencing a huge demand. It's pretty overwhelming, um, especially having the same amount of clientele, but everyone, it's a much shorter time period and everyone's gone so long in between services that it's much bigger project. Brian is thankful to get to work to help her clients with many 12 hour days ahead. Mostly color. Everyone's desperate to get their roots and highlights and something feel good this year and bring a little joy. Clients are eager to get their hair cut too after going so many days without. I feel really relieved. You know, I can be going out looking fresh, you know, <laughs> getting hooked up, but um, yeah, it was great, you know. People need business, we gotta make our money, you know. Tamayo is optimistic that the doors for the personal care industry will remain open as the pandemic continues. Hopefully this doesn't go on, just keep closing and opening again. I mean, we do want to be stable at our job on what we do. In San Luis Obispo, Alexa Bertola, KSBY News.